Hi everyone, it's Liddy and we're gonna go to London today. So I'm gonna take you along and yeah, hope you enjoy the video. I've got some snacks for my journey. So I've got a buffalo chicken wrap, some king prawns, and this is not mine. <laughs> just coming to this anime store that we saw online I wanted to check it out because we were in Common Garden anyway after my piercing so yeah we had a look around this shop and they had a nice selection but it was quite expensive for what it was and I think it's better to buy online but if you want to have a look in store to see what the figures might look like and if you're happy with them and then buy it online I would probably suggest that because I feel like the figures in here were slightly expensive so yeah just keep that in mind but it's nice to have a browse and it was a good experience to have a look at what was there and of course now we're going to the amazing mega store of Forbidden Planet. We're walking towards there now and yeah I had kind of a small list of what I wanted to get and what I wanted to find but as always it doesn't go as planned because this Forbidden Planet gets super packed and super hot in the downstairs area so it can be really really difficult to <laughs> find everything that you want. But here I started off in this section and we can see some Ragnar Crimson and the Promised Neverland. I have been wanting to collect Promised Neverland. And then we have Shaman King, I see Seraph of the End, Seven Deadly Sins. And then this whole row of Chainsaw Man, of course. Chainsaw Man has its dedicated shelf. And then I see Crazy Food Truck and Dead Man Wonderland. And then we have All You Need Is Kill, Alice in Borderland, have you guys been watching Alice in Borderland? And A White Rose in Bloom, which I also haven't started, but that's a GL. And then we've got Banana Fish here, and then Bake Monogatari, Attack on Titan, and then I see Snow White with the red hair, Romantic Killer. I'm surprised it's on the shoujo shelf actually, because I know Romantic Killer isn't a shoujo. Um, and My Happy Marriage, of course, one of my favorite shoujo mangas ever. If you haven't read it, read it now. And I see Cheeky Brat, Yakuza Fiance. Yakuza Fiance is actually a seinen, so that's also on the wrong shelf. <laughs> and then we have some LGBTQ manga. I see Candy Color Paradox. And yeah, something that I've been wanting to collect. And then we've got some more GL here. How to a Relationship, one of my favorites. My Cute Little Kitten, I see. And then I found Yuri is my job, which is one that I've also been reading and really enjoying. Definitely check out this one. It's quite cute. I really enjoyed that one. And then we have Moriarty the Patriot here. And then I see Mashal and also Marmalade Boy. And then obviously My Dress Up Darling, My Hero Academia. I've started watching the anime for this actually, so it's been really fun. And then Kaiju number 8, they still don't have the new volume of Kaiju. I don't think it's out in the UK, but I've seen everyone else get it. Now we're just having a little meal before we go to my concert. So I actually am going to an Epic Kai concert after this. <laughs> Hello everyone, 
I have some packages waiting for me at home, so I decided to open them on this vlog. So yeah, let's see what we have. The first package I've got is Nana. So this is Nana Volume 8. I recently found some really good prices of Nana on Blackwells, so I do have a few in here that I have ordered. They were going for like £5.99 so I ended up buying quite a few but yeah look out on Blackwells for any Nana volumes that are under retail price. And the second package I have here is also two volumes of Nana. The first one is volume 17. This one is looking super cute. The cover is looking really nice. I'm really excited to reread this series as I slowly collect them. And then we've got volume one. So I can actually start reading this, but I only have volume one and I think I have volume two. So I can only start reading volume one. I can see them in the back of my shelves over there, volume two and volume 20. So that's pretty much all I have. But now I have volumes two. 17 1 and yeah and this one is laid back camp so i bought this used on ebay from momox and this pretty much nearly completes my laid back camp collection i think i have just one more that i need to collect and then i have pretty much up to date with everything laid back camp I still haven't started this series, but I'm really excited to start it. I think it's just going to be one of those chill type of mangas that you just read when you want to feel good because obviously it's about camp and about cooking during camping and just making friends. And then I have a wad parcel here. Let's see what's in this wad parcel. I think I know what it is, but I have been finding some good deals on wad lately. So yeah, and then I have... It's a Spy Family Volume 8. So you can see that a little, little bit dirty on the corner, but I think that's fine. We should be able to clean that up. But yeah, I actually found this for under three pounds on Water Books, which is amazing. And the condition is not too bad considering the dirty mark. So yeah, I thought that was a really good deal. And then I have my book depository parcel i don't really remember what i ordered from this one but we shall see i think oh yeah i think i remember now it is it's gat papa daddy at work and at home so i was actually seeing some people on discord talk about this and saying how really cute it was it is also full color and yeah, everyone was saying it was really cute and I went on Book Depository and I found it for like £8 when it's usually like £14.99. So I was really happy about that and so I just nabbed it. But I think this is about like a dad and he kind of goes to work and he's like really cool at work. But when you get home, he's actually super sweet and caring and he takes care of his kids and things like that. So yeah, but that was pretty much my little unboxing. These are the volumes that I got today and unbox and I hope you enjoyed this vlog and this video and I'll see you next time. Bye!